out here. Okay, so yeah, I kind of made a comment here last video, and uh, I regret a lot of it, especially because I later found out. Oh, hey, Abby does not learn a new dark type move at all. Well, without a TM, and even then, it is thief. So no point. Now, yeah, as you can tell, I did level the team up to about 36-ish. So, hopefully this works. Wow, that guy actually does run around the whole thing. Yeah, I'm doing this solely for the experience. Because this saves me a little bit in the long run. Especially because this guy can one-shot a lot of stuff. Okay, that's one bad game. Now, this is going to show my incompetence a lot today, but I'm going to probably take a lot of wrong things. Because, honest truth, I do not remember this rocket hide. Oh, rocket hideout? I've been playing too much leaf feed. But yeah, basically, I haven't played this section for a while, so I forget. And... bada. Okay, I don't know. Nice elixir. That's one. This time you go to the top one. Yeah, like I said, I do not remember the layout of this place for crap. Not knowing you could skip her. Kidding! <laughs> uh, yeah. Listen, guys, this is basically all I'm going to be doing today. Is taking these guys on. Although, I do like some of the character sprites. What's you? Uh, yeah. This is basically what I'm doing today. Oh, there's the master ball. And the rest of the bombs. Wrong one. Yeah, I kind of hate this point. because they got a lot of these stuff. Go figure, that could never make anything easy. One of these, I know, is the right panel. There we go. Okay, I'm going front two of the electrodes. Yep. I am not messing with those things. I do not need the little bombs going off in my mom's face, okay? Especially because I do not intend on losing any more. Now I am sick. Well, empty to shiny hunt a little bit when I get to Browgarn, but I'm also under the times why bought it.
Just... Yeah, I'm basically just gonna surf the whole joint. Hmm. That's funny. I blood a land lover's face. Kind of cool. Slightly. Funny? No. That happened. Sorry, did not realize the camera was off. Oh, Hey, today might be a short video. Oop. Crap! A lot of trainer battles, huh? Yeah, I kinda ran out of things to talk about this week already. Although I do have one thing I wanna make a comment on. I do. I've been seeing a lot of different guys talk about things like like for, you know, Starlet and Violet. And I'm hearing them and I'm just questioning. Okay, so if this does happen, what do you think is gonna be considered the good thing? That's the thing that a lot of guys don't think of is, oh hey, is this a good thing? Or, you know, stuff like that. I don't know. But it's also comical. I'm starting to question if uh, the Pokemon Company has their own fake Weeper. Because there's been this one guy I've been hearing about every now and then from different channels. And the guy posted a picture of that Pokemon Masters game and highlighted a bunch of different things saying, oh hey, these are the details. And what I found funny about it was, oh hey, if you take a look at it, uh, most of what he's talking about gets revealed in the next trailer. And it just it's comical because what I find the most funny, every time somebody does that, it brings hype back up for the series. So what happens when the hype train gets too big? Well, one way to calm it down is do nothing. Just give out a little bit of details on stuff that people aren't going to give two craps about, and it. Just an idea though. Lord knows I am never correct, okay? It could just be, oh hey, some guys go out and decide, hey, I'm gonna risk my job and literally risk the sales and my pay all so I can prove myself right in front of a bunch of dipsticks who will buy the game anyways. Yeah, I said it, we're a bunch of dipsticks who will buy anything. Don't believe me, look at modern day Super Mario games. That should be the exit. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I gotta cover that flopping down. Sorry about that. But yeah. It's just... Every time I hear stuff like this, I'm just questioning... Okay, I know what you're getting at, but I don't understand the ethnics of it. Okay. Now I just go this way. Battle a couple of moms that have bad timing. I should have just put that cleansing tag on. Okay. Who do I have on? Oh crap, I didn't realize he has an item. He's kind of been slacking on me, you know. I mean, it's a great mod, but at the same time, he kind of stinks if all he does is nothing. 
but I'll keep him on the team until the Elite Four. That's one plan I do have. I am not losing him to the Elite Four. Which I also find it funny if you break it down, uh, half the Elite Four is actually weak to Toon. How is it that half the biggest baddies in an entire region are weak to the fire type starting? And before you say, I don't believe you, take a look at the first gym well, Elite Four member, who is a Dark type specialist, and then take a look at the Ice type specialist. Ice is weak to fighting, if I'm recalling correctly. And I took one stop too soon. Okay, what is this guy? Hunter's house. Uh, oh yeah, that. I remember now. Okay. Let me get myself. Yep, right here. Speed. I'll probably go around get some underwater, get some water encounters, I should say. Yeah, this is basically what today's uh, whole episode is going to be. I'll probably go through, get some, well, do some more training, get myself up to level 40. You know, around the level 40-ish, okay? Because I really do not want to risk losing a member of the team, especially to a gym with only two mons in the gym leader's route. Yes, gives me die. Thank you. Give this to uh, Drake here, and I have officially got a mon with a really good attack. And I do have a plan for this gym, but uh, I'm hoping I do not need to use it. But yeah, that's going to basically be it for today. I will do some other stuff off camera, but yeah, that's going to be it. Make sure it saves, that way I don't have to repeat this. And there we go. Well, that's going to be it. Hope to see you guys next time. And remember, be wild.